Hey guys and welcome back and welcome to my channel if you guys are new. I'm Cami. Today's video is going to be a like crock pot what's for dinner. Um, I honestly completely forgot to make an intro so that is kind of why <laughs> this is my current situation with no makeup and looking like a hot mess. Um, but anyways I figured that really didn't matter for the intro part. This isn't a beauty video. Um, but basically I try to do cooking stuff um, once a month or some kind of meal stuff or grocery haul or something like that. Um, so yeah, this is basically just for really, really easy, like kind of like dump and go recipes for your crock pot. It's something that doesn't take up a lot of time. I love crock pot meals personally just because I feel like everything you put in the crock pot just tastes delicious and it's always like comfort food kind of even though most of the meals aren't really like comfort food but I feel like they always just taste really really good um and it's like you know simple because it does like the cooking for you pretty much um so yeah that is what this video is going to be it's going to be for really easy simple meal ideas to do in your crock pot and I do have like a what's for dinner playlist if you guys want to check that out I am probably going to be cutting back on videos here probably doing like four videos a month like for I think I'm gonna post like every Monday um just because I am getting more pregnant and just getting tired and things like that um and I really don't want to just be putting out content to put out content because I said I would post on certain days so I'm probably just gonna be sticking to posting four times or every Monday Okay, so yeah, I'm probably gonna be posting like every Monday um probably some type of cooking or um, video with grocery shopping or whatever and then probably a vlog for now pregnancy update until that is over then I'll be like baby updates and um, a cleaning video so it's probably gonna be like what you're gonna see on this channel T continuing here and there I might pop out another video if I feel like it so probably just videos like every Monday um, just because I feel like that'll be the easiest for me but yeah I hope you guys enjoy this crock pot like meal type situation. Um, if you do, please make sure to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. I would really appreciate it. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoy it. So this first recipe is just like a chicken and rice with cheese. I will leave my recipes that I use to base it off of down below. But I'm just adding the condensed soup and some chicken broth. I used some frozen chicken just because it was easier and then of course my favorite seasoning slap your mama and then some seasoning all seasoning salt this is what it looks like and then after the chicken was cooking for a little bit I took it out so that I can add the rice you can make the rice separate or you could add it like when you did the chicken. I honestly forgot um, and then I had to like put it in there. But yeah, you could just make it separately or just add it in at the beginning. So I shredded up the chicken and added it in there with the rice and it cooked for about four hours. You can do it four to six hours.
this wasn't in the recipe, but I decided I wanted to add some corn in, so I just put a can of sweet corn in there. Mix it all together, and then at the last end, you just add some cheese. I added parsley for color, but we liked this meal. It was cheesy and yummy. Some of the rice was hard because I didn't add it at the correct time, but if I would've, then it would've been like super delicious. meal is the Mississippi roast which we make all the time because it's like our favorite thing. You just use a chuck tender roast and then I add in a couple extra seasonings just because that's what I like but you need au jus gravy, a stick of butter, some pepperoncinis, and some ranch seasoning. I like to shred it and let it sit in the juices for about 30 minutes before we serve it. And we always just do like mashed potatoes with it. if you can hear my kid in the background but this is just a crock pot lasagna you need your favorite pasta sauce or whatever along with some just noodles just lasagna noodles you need some ricotta cheese or cottage cheese whichever you prefer you just mix that around i also use some ground beef and i mix that in with the um pasta sauce a little bit i browned it beforehand you could just do that whenever
but yeah, it's just a, a layer of the sauce, noodles, ricotta, a meat layer, you know, how to make a lasagna. So at the end, I just added some Parmesan cheese and this is what it looked like. It was really good. And we just served this with some Texas toast. Ignore my pregnant belly, but this one was some chicken and dumplings. I wasn't sure if my husband was going to like this because he never really told me if he liked chicken and dumplings or not. But again, here I am just using some frozen chicken because that's what we had and it's super easy. So I put in some onions, some condensed soup, it was two cans, some garlic, and some of the chicken broth. This also called for like poultry seasoning, but I'm sure you could just use whatever chicken seasoning you want. So I think honestly the green flavor parsley is just for like color, um, but we also added some seasoning salt, which I just like and some ground pepper. So after the chicken was cooked, I took it out and shredded it and then it was time to do the dumplings which was basically just the biscuit dough and you just cut it up into how you prefer.
This wasn't in the recipe, but I decided that it would be good, so I just added some mixed vegetables in there for color, and then I go ahead and cut up all the biscuits. So pretty much everything took about four to six hours to cook, um, but you just mix it in there and let the biscuits get a little cooked. And it only took about, I think, like 30 to 40 minutes for them. And my husband actually really enjoyed this, which I was surprised about. He even brought leftovers for work, but it was definitely a good meal and something different. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and it gave you some meal inspiration.